Hi friends, how are you all doing? Welcome to my new home. You can probably tell that it's pretty big. So I'm actually sitting on my knees right now and these cupboards go up to the ceiling, which is like two and a half meters, I wanna say. And it's just a very cool room for my collection. You may notice that I don't have curtains yet, so the light is terrible, but that will happen, hopefully this weekend. This video is all about unpacking first packing and then unpacking my entire collection. So if you like this kind of content, then don't forget to click that subscribe button and hit that bell so you never miss another video of me again. <laughs> Let's get started. I'm first going to show you guys a clip of me packing up my collection, which was in the old house. And then I'm going to show you guys me unpacking the entire collection and then just see the end results. So let me show you guys what I'm working with. So first of all, as I said, I have no curtains, so it's really, really bright in here. But what I did is I have switched my cupboards. So these were actually the cupboards that I used for my books, and now they are going to hold my collection. And this is the uh, other cupboard bookcase. I think this is going to be a potions cabinet or something. I don't know yet. Then over here, this part is not mine. That's um, my boyfriend's part. Um, he's going to have his home office over here with the pretty nice view. And this is the view from the home office, you guys. So that's pretty cool. You can see a little bit of water over there. And I bought a little desk for myself because I had nowhere to put the boxes and the items. So this way I have a nice little place to put everything. So that is actually going to be in front of the bookcase when I'm filming and that way I can show you guys the items better. And that is it for my home office slash Harry Potter room. I'm excited to unpack everything with you guys and let's do this. Two hours later this is definitely not the end result but I wanted to sort everything out first because I want to divide it into different themes so for example this is the Weasleys Honey Dukes movie 4 or book 4 Luna Lovegood Quidditch so I've just gathered up everything and put it into themes my art prints are over here there are some more under the table my books pretty book covers, candles. So that is everything. And now it's step three or step four. I don't even remember anymore um, where I need to put this all together and make it look magical. And this is the result. I have more room for my collection. How awesome is that? And this is only part of my collection because I have three bookcases in the background. There's two more shelves that you guys cannot see and one beneath there. I have another bookcase on this side and I've recently ordered a bookcase for the corner where I wanted to display the more special items in my collection. And behind you guys, I have my art wall where I gathered all the beautiful prints. I mean, a Lima print, a Diagon Alley sign, and I've placed them literally everywhere. So it looks a little bit like the Great Hall. It took me a couple of days to make it look like it looks now. 
and I'm still not entirely finished. I already did a Harry Potter bookcase tour in 2021, so I'm not going to do that again, but I will give you guys an overview of the Harry Potter room. If you have any questions about the items you've seen in my collection, leave them in the comments. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, then please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and let's stay in touch.